Well, good morning, everybody. Guess what I'm doing? Flipping running. Here, let me stop for a second right here. I'll tell you one thing, guys. I became too fat for my liking. So I thought it'd be a good idea to do like a half an hour, an hour run every single morning. And I mean, why not? Look at the view you get when you run. Absolutely flipping awesome. The crazy part is that yesterday was another earthquake. It's like double earthquake. So crazy. When are the earthquakes gonna stop? I have no idea. Anyways, let's continue with our jog. Flipping hell, I'm dying. Is this really supposed to make you healthier? Because I feel like death right now. Oh my God. And the final step of our exercise, run up the stairs. Well, it's funny the way I was running this morning and now I'm taking out pizza boxes. I actually forgot to take out my pizza boxes the last time I was eating Papa John's. So I was laying around for a day. Oh, well, goodbye Papa John's. Oh wow, it's so hot in the car you can't even imagine it. Woo, I need to get the AC to the full. It's 22 degrees as it says right here very very hot wow and I'm starving still hadn't had any breakfast yet after that run I might as well have something healthy well I would have never thought I'd say something like that but you never know the summer season is coming soon maybe I'll actually start looking like Ivan five years back because back in the day I used to be more skinny probably because I had been walking a lot, you know, to the subway, to the bus, and cycling to school. And then when I got my driver's license, I had a ladder, which in its way is a very good physical exercise because it didn't have power steering, it was a manual, and it was just an old car. So yeah, a lot of exercise, not like in this big Boeing 747 of a Cadillac right here. So I don't know if it's gonna be a healthy day today, but I'd say a car will pass through here. Anyways, we came to the fish market. The local market is working today, so there's barely any parking spaces here. Evelyn is gonna have some fish soup, and Vladimir said that me and him should have some Chinese sweet and sour soup to try it out. Anyways, Evelina doesn't want that, so she's gonna have fish soup, and then we're gonna drive over to the Chinese restaurant and have that. You can see some bananas being sold here. I always wondered why they have so much pumpkins here. Look at the amount of pumpkins. They actually make desserts out of it. Like all sorts of things they made out of pumpkins. Like pumpkin soup, pumpkin dessert, pumpkin whatever the heck. I don't know. Tell me if you had any pumpkin dessert. Well, pumpkin pie, I guess. But what would you make out of a pumpkin? Except a soup and a dessert. I don't know. Like I said, there's a market. And from this place where Evelina is going to eat, you could see a flipping market right here. Look, they have all sorts of things here. You have some mandarins, everything. And the locals are shopping here because it's way cheaper, because there's peppers, everything here. Anyways, let's go back and see how Evelina is gonna eat. And then we're gonna try out some Chinese soup that Vladimir is talking about all these days. Look, and here beside the restaurant, they cook a little fish right here. Hello. <laughs> Look at this. Best chef El Alanya, yes? Yeah. <laughs> Very nice. Well, maybe one day we're gonna try it out. 
Anyway, so let's get to Evelina. So the bazaar is literally behind me and it goes on every single Tuesday. So every single Tuesday, people come over to this place so they could buy some fresh vegetables for a very good price. Vegetables, fruits, spices, and maybe eat a bit of that small fish which is being fried. This is how Turkish people drink coffee. This is called Turkish coffee. It looks like an espresso cup. And some people actually say that Turkish coffee is really close to Cuban coffee. I have no idea. I've never tried it. We'll have to ask some coffee expert about that, but it's very good. And this is how Evelina eats soup. Look at this. Soup and all of this comes with the soup. Flipping amazing. Vladimir comes with the soup as well. Look, wearing a yellow t-shirt, drinking a orange drink. Summer. Summer has come. And the weather is like beautiful 20 degrees right now awesome soon it's gonna be time to actually go for a good old swim in the sea so i thought it'd be a good idea to let vladimir try out my favorite thing in this market it's like this dried fried corn with spices or something like that so we're gonna get that right now Merhaba. can i have five lira of this no, 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 five lira. Five lira, ma. Yeah. Minimum fifty. Small, lira. small. Fifty lira minimum. Minimum fifty. Yeah. Oh, it'll be very big. Can we do twenty lira? Twenty lira. So this is the thing that I got. It's like the best dried, fried corn with spices. It's flipping amazing. Now I wanted to only get five lira worth, but they made me get thirty liras worth. So, whatever. But we're gonna try. To give this to Vladimir for a try to see if he likes it or not so guys Vladimir said that this place has very good sweet and sour soup so we're gonna test it out in the sushi China royal takeaway whatever the heck let's go have a taste of it look at this guys we got jasmine tea and it's being warmed up by the candle this is this feels very authentic if you ask me very authentic that's for me thank you very much and the soup for me as well thank you very much okay let's try out the rice first yeah perfect. Lotus. this is actually very good really really good and now the sweet and sour soup vladimir is telling me it's really hot so let's be careful boys with tasting this soup mm, this is good very good guys the reviews of this place aren't that good because i was reading them before but vladimir said it's actually very good so we came over here and it's actually good so yeah i recommend this place definitely wait it's tuesday right yeah it's tuesday for me anyways as i said question and answers anyways we got like three questions that i'm gonna answer in this video because that's the only questions we got so far anyways the first question that i got was from bernie cooper i'm not gonna say exactly how he said it you can see it right here but he said what happened to your two friends that went back to russia nothing really happened to them they're just living normal life and um, yeah nothing happened to them if you're wondering if they got like mobilized or anything like that that's not the case now joanne baril hopefully i'm pronouncing your name right I would like to know if Evelyn is learning English or another language. Well, she's actually planning to learn English just a matter of time. I don't know when she's going to start learning, but one day she will. And Joey Seely002 has asked what cats, what breed of the cats we got. It's actually not Siberian cats like you said in the message. They're actually a mix of Maine Coon and British, that is the red one and the black one is a mix of Maine Coon and some random cat that had some fun time with his mother that's the questions and answers done anyways guys next time send me a video of your questions so it'd be more interesting to watch anyways time to drink some americano coffee right now i swear this is the best coffee in alanya look at this that painting you've all been talking about I actually made a video about those paintings in one of my vlogs so you better watch through every single one of them to find what is this
well you know what we're back home early today i'm gonna change the cat's toilet and then we're gonna take pachinka for a walk and maybe the other cat called Ponchik. So I'm trying to get the black cat to go outside, but he's a bit afraid. So we're gonna see if he's gonna go down or not. So we got Ponchik with us. He's a little bit afraid. So let's see what he does. Maybe he'll go with the ginger cat. He's a little bit afraid. Let's go, don't be afraid, you're with me. He's taking small steps for humanity. One small step for cat, one big step for humanity. Oh, don't sneak those shoes. No, 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 let's go. Look at him walk around the place cat's just chilling 7 17 right now and the cat is chilling outside he's enjoying now the ginger cat is actually with evelina walking around the place we thought it'd be a great idea to give them a good old nighttime walk oh wow he's really enjoying this look at him <laughs> look at him he's really enjoying this i'm so happy for him Truly enjoying the night walk when there's less noises. Oh my god, I'm so happy for my cat enjoying walking around. This is awesome. Maybe I'll train them and we'll walk around the place. That'd be awesome. I think the cats are tr that cat is trying to speak to Pichenka and he's trying to get here. Guys, hopefully you enjoyed today's vlog. It wasn't as fun and not much activity going on this time, but it is a daily vlog. Some vlogs are boring, some are not. But I try my best to make them more interesting for you guys. Anyways, if you enjoyed it or if you didn't, you might as well press the like button, subscribe, and comment in the comment section below. See you later, guys.